Despite a rainy evening in normally sunny South Dallas, Texas A&M Commerce staged the second annual Harvey Martin Classic at the Cotton Bowl. We're just excited to be here at the game. Whether or not it's raining or not, it's not going to put our spirit down. We're just here to support him and to support the team. Besides the football game, Saturday was a time to celebrate the legacy of the late Harvey Martin, former Dallas Cowboys great and Texas A&M Commerce alum. Martin's mother, Helen Martin, attended the game and talked about her son's induction into the Texas Sports Hall of Fame. I was very thrilled about that because he had waited such a long time for that recognition. Mm -hmm. And I knew he wasn't going to get it from the Cowboys. Mm -hmm. And I was glad that his school gave it to him. Martin's son, DeVincent, talked about Texas A&M Commerce approaching the family with the idea of honoring his late father. The athletic director, Carlton Cooper, actually got in touch with me, told him his vision uh, and what he had felt that uh, what my dad would be bringing to the university uh, with the alumni base that was sitting in Dallas that he thought he thought that it would be a great uh, glue bring together for, for the alumni here and, you know, for the city of Commerce. Texas A&M Commerce athletic director, Carlton Cooper, played host to the Harvey Martin Classic even spending time working in the ticket booth. He discussed how this year's game compared to the inaugural event. You know, I think this game today shows uh, that it's working. You know, the tennis is, is better. Uh, we uh, got a different group of people here. You know, we have a lot of our players from the 90s decade that are in attendance today, which we didn't have before. Had a, I said a small group went from about 12 last year to about a, you know, 100 this year. So, uh, and I give our hats off to Abilene. They, they brought, their attendance was good. They brought a lot of people out. And I know they did a lot of work marketing this event, so. But I'm really proud of our alumni. I mean, because, you know, uh, people were, you know, most of the ticket sales prior to the game had been Abilene. But I tell you, our people, they showed up. The Lions put up a good fight, but were outscored 20 to 14 by Abilene Christian, the number two ranked team in Division II. Carla Lacey was at the Cotton Bowl for Dallas South News and had a chance to speak with a proud parent of a commerce football player. Would you mind sharing with us what playing here at the Cotton Bowl means to you? Oh, it means so much to me. My son is here. He plays with uh, Texas A&M Commerce. And this is the second year at this class. So I'm very excited about him uh, playing here. We're from Wetumpka, Alabama, and I'm just, I'm just thrilled to be here.